so good morning students today we'll see an important portion on the part a that is the questions involving theories of failure so this is our question a cylindrical shaft made of steel of yield strength 700 megapascal is subjected to static loads consisting of bending moment 10 kilo newton meter and torsional moment of 30 kilo newton meter determine the diameter of the shaft using two different theories of failure assume factor of safety equal to FOI stands for factor of safety take E equal to 210 gigapascal and Poisson ratio mu equal to 0 0.5 so here we should understand that there are two loadings bending as well as torsion and both loads are static they are 10 kilo newton meter and 30 kilo newton meter each so in such cases we have to apply theories of failure which are given in the data book page number 21 so take the page number 21 in data book uh, we can see that equation 2.88 that is maximum normal stress theory sigma e equal to sigma x plus sigma y by 2 plus root of sigma x minus sigma y by 2 square plus tau x y square so you can take that page and you can see that equation here on the left side you should be putting the design stress sigma e is the design stress and instead of sigma x here we have only bending load sigma x should be subtracted by m by z and tau x y should be given as t by z p now, what is the value of bending moment bending moment is given as 10 kilo newton meter 10 kilo newton meter in this case so it should be subtracted in newton millimeter so you have to multiply it 10 power 6 so 10 multiplied by 10 power 6 newton millimeter and is that equal to pi dq by 32 for circular shaft and we will be getting sigma x in terms of dq 1.02 into 10 power 8 by dq similarly we can find tau xy because the torsion will be producing a shear stress torsion will be producing a shear stress tau and that tau is acting in tau xy so tau xy equal to t by zp torque is given as 30 kilo newton meter so 30 multiplied by 10 power 6 divided by zp equal to pi dq by 16 you can take it from page number 13 so zp equal to pi dq by 16 substituting you will be getting tau xy equal to 1.53 into 10 power 8 by dq now we can substitute these values sigma x and tau xy in this equation and we can see that in this equation there is no stress along y axis so sigma y tends to 0 we can see that uh, sigma y turns to 0 so this term cancel out and now we can find the value of diameter uh, you can substitute in the equation you will be getting the diameter equal to 84.64 mm now in this question we are asked to find the values using two different theories so now we will go for the second theory that is a maximum strain theory I selected this one because the Poisson ratio is given so here sigma e is known mu is a Poisson ratio Poisson ratio is given as 0.25 and we can substitute the value sigma x and tau xy similar to the previous step we will be getting the value of diameter at 88.16 mm diameter equal to 88.16 mm so in this session we see that uh, whenever we have bending moment and torsion and if both are static we can apply theories of failure thank you for watching